Welcome back. She is a beautiful mother of two who's great at baking peanut butter pies and playing cornhole. It is our producer, Nikita, and it is her birthday. She's joining us today. Happy birthday, Nikita! Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> She's the sweetest person we know. We love her so much. Okay, so now Nikita usually likes to stay behind mm -hmm. the scenes. You guys, if you've been watching while, well, you know that she literally wants to kill us right now for making her be out here. But last year we made her come on set for Nikita's Sexiest Man Alive Gauntlet. That's where she had to pick her own Sexiest Man Alive because she disagreed with People Magazine's pick that year. It was Paul Rudd. And today it's time for the Nikita's Birthday Date Gauntlet. Uh, we have photos of several celebrity hotties in Nikita's age range. These are either a year older or a year younger or the same age as her. Uh, she'll have to narrow them down to see which one she wants to take on a date for a very special date. Oh, are she's you ready, not taking Nikita? them. They're taking her. Oh, right. That's an important distinction. <laughs> All right, you ready to get started? Yes, Nikita, are you ready? Ready. Nikita right. has not seen any of these choices, and don't you worry, we've taken great care of you. All right, you want to introduce our first one? Let's do it. Originally from Pennsylvania, this actor can sing, play piano, and the guitar, and he loves to cook, Nikita. Hey. He loves to travel, and he speaks French. He's also held the title of People's Sexiest Man Alive. It is a young Bradley Cooper. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Now, like your Bradley first... Cooper. Now here we are in your first gauntlet because the next person you must choose between these two, another winner of the Sexiest Man Alive, this Oklahoma-born country singer has a restaurant chain inspired by his music. But be prepared for unique pets because this man once owned a pet turkey. It's Blake Shelton. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, wow. Now you pick one to eliminate and then we'll throw them away like the trash that you've decided they are. Blake Shelton. Throw him away. Bye bye. Okay. Oh, I thought you meant you chose right. him, and I was like, really? I mean, no, no, hey. But Do I? Does this mean I win because I'm holding the winner? Yeah, you get to hold the winner. Okay. All right. So, so far, it's Bradley Cooper. So far, so far, you win, and you get to go with them on their date. <laughs> I'm supervising. I'm chaperoning. This star athlete hails from London, England. He loves tattoos, many of which are dedicated to his family. He's also really into philanthropy. It's David Beckham, <sighs> ladies and gents. Oh. Now this is a tough matchup, Nikita. Yeah. Agreed. Agreed. Who do you think? I'm getting rid of David Beckham. <gasps> oh! Whoa! I did not see that going this way. I love these descriptions of these gents. Look at here. Bradley two Cooper two. is, though. I know. Look at him. And look at him waving at you. He's like, hey, girl. Hey, he is. He's, what are you doing? He's coming hey. to pick you up. He's in the car waving. I'm outside. No, he'll come to the door. <laughs> oh, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> if he's not, we're getting rid of him. Yeah, I'm here. <laughs> Come on out. Because <laughs> he's not taking you on a date. Okay, this New York-born funny man is sure to make you smile. Besides his career as a comedian, Nikita, he once worked as a Calvin Klein model. <gasps> a fun fact about him is he once aspired to be a priest. It's Jimmy Fallon. He wanted okay. to be a priest. He that seems to be a priest. Too, like two wildly different things. A priest and a Calvin Klein model. Mm. <laughs> Could you be both? <laughs> Could you be both? <laughs> yeah, a Calvin Klein model to priest to comedian. Lee's dream. <laughs> he just didn't know what he wanted to do. <laughs> I, I'm sorry, but I got to get rid of him. Jimmy oh, Fallon. Ooh, three for three. Were we wrong for I'm putting Brad? No, no, this is right. Cooper this is the first. best outcome. I okay. Think, cause I win. <laughs> this. <laughs> You again, this has nothing Whoever to do with Whoever wins between you. us gets to chaperone. Oh, cool. So they get the leftovers <laughs> or something. I don't know. <laughs> Y'all are doing Y'all gonna eat that? Take your stuff. And Bradley's like, because he's taking her to a nice place. He can afford it. Yeah, he can. Yeah, I've seen his checkbook. Have you? Yeah. Um, it has how I'm much money he's worth written on it. Written on it, it says like today's net worth. <laughs> You know they are. Mm -hmm. Okay, this Emmy Award winning actor is originally from St. Louis. Any guesses? Mm -hmm. Do you know any stars from St. Louis, Nikita? No. Well, you're going to learn about him. Every year for his birthday, he celebrates by going on a run. So he's a bit of a health nut. It's Sterling K. Brown. <gasps> oh, Certified okay. hottie. You know, I don't, do like to work out. Yes, that's me. true. Nikita is very into fitness. Don't I do like down, to work Nikita, out. Nikita, I've held on for so long. I <laughs> know, uh, but I'm going with Bradley Cooper. Ah, ha, ha. Bye -bye. Continued success with Bradley Cooper. <laughs> <laughs> so, sorry, Starling. I did like him in This Is Us. Yes, such a good show. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. My wrists are getting carpal tunnel from picking up pictures. <laughs> I'm getting kind of bored because I've just been holding the same picture. <laughs> this actor hails from Delaware and has a black belt in Taekwondo. Any ideas? Fire. No? He's Will also he fight a huge. For would he fight for Nikita? <laughs> if he was on The Bachelor, that would be his tagline. <laughs> He's also a huge baseball fan, and he named his son after one of his ancestors who was a pitcher for the Pittsburgh Pirates. Oh. It's Ryan 
Philippe, Philippe, Philippe. Can I say something? Ex of Reese Witherspoon. Right, yes, I think Little, he's cute. Yeah, and this was the only um, picture we didn't have to pay for of him. <laughs> and so I just want you to just soak this in. He's screaming, baby, come back to you. Has, is it, has America been around long enough, or has like, the United States been around long enough to call someone an ancestor from there? <laughs> you raise a good point. Ryan, you silly dog. Let He's me guess, Nikita, let me guess. Uh, he does make beautiful kids, though, because Reese Witherspoon's kids are beautiful. They, they are really are. Adorable. They really are. But I'm getting rid of him. Sorry. <laughs> All right, we got to get our final pick in. Oh, Ooh, this is going to be good. Your final pick. Straight to the end. Yeah, we, we've been, we've just been chit chatting. Noah took up most of the time saying that he won. This hilarious actor was the first Canadian to be voted People's Sexiest Man Alive. He has his own gin, his own mobile phone company, and owns a Welsh soccer team. Nikita, this is it. He does it all. It's Ryan Reynolds. How? How? <laughs> oh, <laughs> no, Nikita. No, Nikita, listen. Nikita, no, we've been through so oh, much. No, no, let the woman choose. Okay. <laughs> we've been through so much. Ryan Reynolds. Oh, no. Yes! He is so hot. Look You're at this. trash. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. Look at that. Can't you see he and Nikita together? Look at him. All right, we'll, yeah, get, we'll, get, we'll call him. He's so yeah. cute. Tell him to call Congratulations, me. Congratulations, Ryan. I know this means more to you than any awards you've ever gotten. 